on YouTube, it's Baker. Welcome back to Blue Line Morphs. This just might be the last video I ever film here at the original Blue Line Morphs headquarters. The facility should be up painting it tonight. Today is, what is today? I don't know what today is. Today is Monday the 15th, so next Tuesday I am moving in over there. So I got two videos lined up for Wednesday. And yeah, I think this might be the last video, guys. Kind of is what it is. That being said, I got another egg cutting video. Now, if you remember, in the beginning of the season, I had spoke about how one of my old powerlifting buddies gave me a female pretty much for free. And by pretty much, I mean free. Uh, and it happened to be a, a nice little cute butter girl. And she was kind of sitting there. She was relatively small, only about 900 grams, give or take. I said, you know what? I like bells. Why don't we throw her to this boy, my Core Glow Black Pastel Trick Mojave male, and we'll just see what happens, right? Ended up getting like only two locks in there. And then sure enough, those two locks were good enough to kick out that clutch right there of six, seven eggs actually, or six, six eggs, I don't remember. Either way though, guys, that's what we're gonna be cutting today. We're looking to hit some bells, looking at some nice core glow combos. This boy right here is an absolute beast for me. He's kicked out, oh, I don't know, about 10 clutches for me, nine or 10 clutches for me over the last, I don't know, two seasons, give or take. So I'm pretty happy about that. Probably letting this butter girl go. So she's obviously a proven breeder now. Uh, back on food, good to go. So if you're interested in her, let me know. Single gene butter. But this boy right here is already, look, he's already trying to lock with her. Look at him. Look at him. Some people got no shame. Some people got, look, she's like, I'm out of here. You don't have to pay your child support, I'm out. Anyway, guys, listen, let's get ready. Got my tripod set up. Let's, hey, mama bear. Let's, let's cut this clutch, guys. Let's see how many bells we hit. Comment down below how many bells think we're going to hit. Some nice Mojave bells. Some Mojave butter bells. I'm going to go with two. I'm saying two now. Two. Comment down below. What do you guys think? Let's get set up. Let's cut it. And let's intervene on this before this turns into a rape. All right, guys. We're back at it. So as you see, my little ghetto riding on the tub situation. Uh, today's day 60. So, hey, hey, hey. What's up, bud? All right. So by Pippin, I meant, I meant they're out of the egg. Fantastic. You're a little overachiever. What do we got here? What do we got here? There's no pastel involved. So it looks like just a Coral Glow Mojave. Cool. Little Coral Glow Mojave animal, chilling, doing his thing. Uh, all right, let's cut this open. He's going to be paying the ass now. Kind of is what it is, guys. So again, this is a Coral Glow Black Pastel Trick Mojave Clutch bred to that butter girl. Essentially, he's a free girl, right? I got her from my buddy uh, whose buddy didn't want her anymore. And she's pretty much good to go. Threw my bail to her, see what happened. And this is what happened. A normal. <laughs> cool. Little normal. Chilling. Nothing crazy there. I haven't hatched out a normal in a while. It wasn't had anything. So a nice normal. Somehow we missed out on five genes. That in itself is pretty impressive. I don't see any trick. Not black pastel. It's not Mojave. It's not butter. Cool. Somehow we missed out on five genes, guys. How we did that, I have no idea. But that in itself is hitting the odds, right? If you think about it. It doesn't always have to be good. But sometimes you hit the odds and it's not good and that's the odds right there you got five genes involved and you hit deadly hit all right got a lesser off the bat black pastel lesser maybe i don't know definitely lesser i think it's just a lesser I think it's just a butter cool so far we're getting destroyed on the odds guys absolutely crushed no bells so far on three eggs so if my premonition here is supposed to come correct I don't know if we're actually going to hit it. So let's see what happens here. You had to come out, buddy. You like the best snake so far. So, so far, definitely a normal. Looks like a lesser, maybe a lesser black pastel. I don't think so, though. I think it's just a lesser. Butter, sorry, butter. It's a butter female. Sold as butter. I don't want to keep calling it a butter. Don't want to make up my own shit. And, oh, another coral glow. Very nice. This looks like black pastel coral glow. That's what I'm going with on that one. So we got a Coral Glow Mojave and a Coral Glow Black Pastel. All right, at least we got some Coral Glow action going on. Not bad. Love my Coral Glow combos. No bells so far, man. No bells at all. I'm surprised. I thought I'd get at least one so far. So this is egg number four. And so far we got none. So if this isn't a bell, I am wrong with my prediction. And it is not a bell. It's another Coral Glow Black Pastel. I'll take that, though. I like that a lot. This is a really nice combo. Sick looking combo. So it looks like we got two Coral Glow Black Pastels here. Coral Glow Mojave right there. Last egg, guys. Last egg to hit a bell. Am I going to hit a bell? 
Holy shit, hold on a second here. So we got a normal. We're getting crushed on these dots. I don't normally I do pretty well. No, no, no. No, 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 no. So we got a normal right here. Very nice. Very nice. I you know I love my normals. Definitely a lesser. I'll be honest with you, I'm not familiar with what lesser black pastel looks like. So as of now, definitely a butter. Sorry, butter, 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 butter. This overachiever right here. I couldn't wait for everybody. For real. We got a nice Coral Glow Mojave. I'm assuming it's a male, but obviously we got to check, but Coral Glow Mojave, that was overachiever, out and about, ready to breed. Then these two, I believe, are both Coral Glow Black Pastels, really purple looking, gorgeous animals. So, we did get three Coral Glow so far, which I'm pretty happy about, um, which is decent odds, I guess. Well, that's actually where it should be, right? The 50% of them should be uh, Coral Glow, but we should get at least one bell, right? I think the odds are, what are the odds here, guys? Six, no, 30%, 33%, I think? I don't know. I don't know. I'm not good at this shit. I uh, see white. I see white. Give me one bell. Give me one bell. Yeah. Hey, mama. There we go. One little bell. All right. So we could say we're only one off, but I mean, one bell sitting there chilling, looking gorgeous. Really happy about that. Um, I love hatching out bells. I will always love hatching out bells. Hey, Bubba. All right. I'm filled with shit. Where's my paper towels? All right, so not bad so far, guys. We didn't get our two bells, which I anticipated, but you know what? That is what it is. We did get three coral glows, and somehow we hit a normal, which I am somewhat impressed about. I'm not going to lie. Five genetics involved in this clutch. Coral glow, black pastel trick, Mojave, and butter, and we get a normal. I don't see any trick in this clutch, though. Zero. Zero trick. Interesting. Hi, Bell. Hi, Mama Bear. You're not a twin, are you? Every time I see a big egg, I, I, I expect twins, but I don't think I... I, I know. I know. I thought I messing with you. All right, guys. Let me take them off the dragon has tray. Shout out to Bishop. And then let me take a closer look at these with you guys. Let me get set up. And we'll take a little closer look at what we got. But we're pretty sure what the fuck we got. Stand by. One little closer look at them. Um, not much really to see here, guys. Either way, I love hatching out snakes. I'm happy with that. So right away... Coral Glow Mojave boy. I'm assuming boy, he's a male maker. I have got one female from him though. So I'm assuming it's a boy. Nice Coral Glow Mojave right here. We did get our one bell, which I'm happy about. So we do have a Mojave Lesser, a Mojave Butter right here. Obviously we'll determine if it's a male. And we'll hit it with the old uh, light test to kind of see if, I don't know, kind of see if uh, it's got those red eyes to see if it's actually Coral Glow. Also, this right here we're calling just a normal. Can't go wrong with normals though, guys. All right, can't go wrong with normals. It could be black pastel. Now I'm looking at it, but I don't think so. Black pastel is a lot darker. That's not black pastel. That's a normal. Right here, we got a butter. Really nice looking butter. The pattern normally with butter and black pastel has got that crazy wonky looking pattern. I don't see that here. Eh, kind of right there, but the butter kind of does that too. So we'll see what it gets out, but I'm going to call that a butter for now. Then we got another Coral Glow black pastel. And another Coral Glow Black Pastel right there. So I'm pretty happy with this clutch, guys. I enjoy hatching out the Coral Glow Black Pastels just because I love the purple hues that come along with them. I think they're absolutely gorgeous. And even the Coral Glow Mojave, you kind of see the difference between the two. Someone asked me the other day, how do you determine so quickly that which one's a Coral Glow Black Pastel, which one's a Coral Glow Mojave? Well, look, you see the oranges and the dark purples. You see the lighter, like, I don't know. What do you want to call that? beige color? You see the difference? See there? All right, and over here you have the same thing. You see there, right, like all here, plus the alien heads. Mojave always makes these nice, tiny, little, like reduced alien heads, like this. That kind of is an indication right away uh, of Mojave to me. But either way, guys, I've hatched out enough and to kind of determine what they are. So then flash forward over here, give you guys a quick update on this clutch. This is the Pastel Enchi Blade Leopard Clown to my Fire Blade uh, Blade Clown. So far, guys, all six eggs, all six snakes have come out. Really good looking clutch. I'm taking the light a little bit for you. Really good looking clutch. Uh, <laughs> only issue is we got one female and fucking five males, man. We got destroyed. This guy's nice right here. Look at this thing. This right here looks like, I don't know, that's a female? I, I forget which one's a female. Stand by. That's a female. I actually be very, very happy. Because this one, it looks like uh, Enchi Fire. And it's a male. Figures. Whatever. All right. This one's really nice, though. Little Enchi Fire Leopard Clown. Really good looking male. Couple blade, couple Enchi Blade right here. This guy, right, another Leopard Enchi, a Leopard Blade right there. Then we got, uh, this looks like 
yeah, this this one right here looks like I'm gonna go with fire pastel. Why is his head so white? He's not super pastel. He looks super pastel, but pastel is not on both sides. So really interesting on that one. I'm kind of confused. Like, definitely fire, fire pastel clown. Maybe leopard too. And then this one right here obviously is a uh, another fire pastel uh, entry. So maybe that's the difference. The entry is kind of having that play with it. But either way though, guys, we're moving along here. Pretty happy with this. The next clutch we're gonna cut. Um, is going to be the banana head, yeah, banana head clown to the same male pastel entry blade leopard clown. That's that clutch right there. That's due in two days. So I actually I lied. I might end up filming that video at this facility here, and then moving the clutch over to the new facility once it's done. Either way though, guys, pretty happy with how we're moving along here. Blue line morphs, guys. We're a long ways away from when we first started. Um, pretty still don't know what the fuck we're doing but I'm pretty happy with the trajectory in which we're going. So as always, guys, I appreciate you guys. Love you guys. Shout out to my Patreon peeps. I uh, love that little community we built, little family, little, as we say, welcome to the shit show. It's uh, nothing but banter and mainly shitting on me, but that's cool. Either way though, guys, listen, I appreciate you watching. Be safe. Watch your six.